A schema kind of goes like this. When you were a little kid, maybe a baby, your parents pointed to the dog and they said dog. And you say, okay, cool, dog. And then a cow came by one day and you said doggy. And parents say, no, 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 that's not a dog, that's a cow. And then another little animal came in with four legs and fur and that was a cat. And you say, okay, so there's three different types of animals. There's dog, there's cat, and then there's cows. But you also notice that some dogs are big and then some dogs are really small. But just because it has four legs, a tail, doesn't mean it's a dog. It could be a cow, it could be a cat, or it could be something else. The problems with these schemas is they're limited. If it doesn't fall within a schema once you develop it, you don't even hear it half the time. You don't absorb it. It goes in one ear and out the other. And so when you get stuck in these patterns of limitation where you can no longer grow, it's because something's limiting in the schema.